get some practice get some practice get some practice one day two day three day in this way it will be your habit because habit is the key to your better life better future oil it's me Silas. welcome to my channel sbrc infosys nepal so if you are new to this channel please go to the description you will find the link to our playlist and other video are uploaded in this playlist well guys in this 11th video of front end development i'm gonna teach you about html with css part one in this way I, i'm going to teach you uh, part two part three html with css let's start in our computer screen okay buddies now we are in our computer screen open any text editor like sublime text and then you can uh, save the file first of all uh, whatever you can save the name uh, i'm set here html and css.html uh, but don't miss the dot html uh, this is the extension file extension name then uh, here you can type the some basic uh, html code then under the body uh, you can write here uh, visible code it uh, like this uh, in h1 uh, i'm going to type here what happening oh yeah uh, i'm going to type here hello nepal beyond e p a l nepal then close this uh, h1 tag let's see how it look like yeah there is the output output is hello nepal uh, okay now i'm going to uh, set the property of, uh, style of this uh, text uh, for example style is cost to i need the background uh, color then you can set the properties background color is cost to here you can set the value of background color uh, like uh, uh, whatever you want uh, I, I i would like to set here has zero zero this one is black black color uh, and if i need to set here um text color then you can tap here directly color c o l o r color uh, color then colon uh, here type your uh, text or uh, color name has uh, oh, mistake here has f f f triple f this one uh, has f f f is the uh, white color this is the color coach name oh what's happening yeah no. Uh, we, uh, there is some problem we have to uh, set this uh, double inverted comma uh, here uh, yeah now it's uh, working let's see how it look like replace it yeah background color and this one okay guys mm, again I'm going to say the next property and uh, this one is text align text align uh, you can by using this text align you can set the uh, text positions like left right center and whatever you want um, left right where you write this one then you can set here like this I'm going to set the right there is the this text one is start from right and you can change here um, for example center and you can uh, set the uh, left also by default this uh, text align is to be a left so i'm going to set here this one is center then next one is our width you can set the width of the um, width of the background color uh, like this you can set in pixel or also you can set in percentage like this you can see here 
this one is the with uh, also you can set the set in a uh, percentage like this 50 percent with its cost to 15 for 50 percent then replace it this one is 50 percent when you uh, reduce the zoom it uh, zoom in or out then it will be uh, uh, total size of 50 percent of total size of um, your computer screen let's, let's see next one is you can set your height height you can set this height in uh, pixel like this 200 pixel uh, let's see how it look like your this is a height height is look like this uh, okay guys you can change this uh, in the percentage but this percentage is not working uh, because there is uh, uh, not a fixed height for uh, our desktop uh, fixed height of in percentage only so that you uh, we have to uh, set in uh, pixel height is uh, we have to save the height in pixel not in percentage yeah i'm going to set this one yeah i'm going to i have to zoom this one to easier to see to you okay guys and you can also set here next one is font family font family means the uh, you can change the font uh, family uh, uh, of your text like this uh, here this is the hello nepal this one is our text uh, if i need to change uh, here font family name uh, ariel a r i a l ariel and you can change whatever you want to uh, change uh, you can set uh, in which font you would like mm. this one is done okay and uh, next one i'm going to add the next another content like x1 here i'm going to type uh, hello india x e l l o hello india <coughs> hello india but uh, i need the same content here then you can type here uh, all the same code you can copy and paste uh, like this then it will be uh, showing like the same and uh, there is the all property is same and content only different but in this way this is not a good habit there is the all code are repeated so if i need to buy one code you can set here under the head um, style tag uh, we have a style tag uh, here you can type here um which one this is the heading h1 then you can set here h1 h1 will be uh, all property like this then h1 then uh, open the curly bracket here you can type here um, all the same code of h1 tag um, background color it goes to uh, h00 Hat zero, zero means black color okay guys uh, don't be confused um, it is the color code name you can also directly type the black uh, and next I'm going to say the color of text it has F F F this one is white color and text align it's close to center you can set whatever you like uh, center or left or right or whatever 
I'm going to set the center and next one is which it cost uh, 50% you can set here 20% 30% but I set here 50% and height is cost to 100 pixel you have to set the height in pixel not to in um, percentage and here I'm going to, uh, to set here font family is cost to Arial you can change this font family name what you like then now I don't need this code to repeat then I'm going to remove this property let's see by one code it will be working there is no different okay guys by only one line one line code then you can add the any content uh, like hello japan then it will be same property content only added but all property will same like this uh, to above there is this one is but we need to text color only different uh, content different but others property will same then you have to set your div 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 then uh, you can set the by uh, uh, selective uh, style uh, you can set here uh, like this look here I'm going to show you uh, by div what is div how is working by using here you can set the multiple uh, classes like this i'm going to show you um class it's cost to abc then for uh, second one and uh, this one is for uh, for this xyz class then for next one is um efg this is the different different class uh, according to your um, uh, content you can set here um, remove this one that's one then also we have to uh, one common um, class uh, common class is our a a dot a it's cost uh, we have to set here um, this one is the same uh, we need to remove this color this uh, color uh, text color is uh, uh, different different but other property will same let's see if it's cost you uh, can set here uh, color it's uh, red then for xyz dot xyz for xyz color is goes to green g r e e n green okay there is uh, just missing a semicolon you can set here and for efg dot efg uh, ef efg for efg uh, color is goes to um blue b l e e blue yeah let's see how it look like oh there is some problem it's not working oh th this one is not mm, you can remove this there is no any equals let's see now now let's see uh, this one is working uh, all text um, color are different content are different but others property will same same property will set by a class and thank you for watching the video guys if you are new to this channel 
please do not forget to subscribe our channel if you are already part of the channel do not forget to practice every day and do not forget to share with your friend because sharing is caring if you enjoy this one i would like to say make sure do subscribe our channel to never miss an update and hit that like button it will be motivate me to make new videos so leave the comment below hashtag challenge accepted and do practice every day